Our God Self, via its post Garuda, I am. Web page, Radiantly Happy, at blogspot.com. Beloveds. I am. You are, as a finite being, identified with thoughts about what you are, not. I am is not what you think. I am begins when your vibration rises above the frequency of thought and even the higher mind and the total body mind that is the cosmos. I am is not even the frequency of the stillness of the heart in the middle of your chest. Because it is bound to a location that is body based and belongs to the mortal human psycho physical structure. I am is the untouched radiant beauty of transcendental and eternal being, prior to you and also containing you, who keeps a separate point of view, with a center and a circumference. I am is centerless. It is. It is therefore above point of view and its ramifications. Above, not locally above, but above as the non dual reality. Many of you only think I am, identified with a finite body mind and think that you know what it is. But the truth is, most of you know nothing beyond mind. You merely have an idea, an intuition perhaps, a feeling about it. And what you do is to project this idea from your presumed center within the circumference, thereby creating an imagination. Most of you are submitted to random thought patterns, suggesting you are in touch with a real source. But this is not so. There are veils after veils of mind disguising me. And so you are bereft of your own truth in divine reality, creating ideas of want and need about matters of ascension, ideas that would hopefully make ineffective the pain and suffering of this existence in low density. It is a hopeful escape. Escaping the unreal creates more unreal worlds, as escaping itself is a gesture of illusion. You cannot escape, not one situation, because you always take with you what you desire to escape. It is done with a desperate hope not to have to deal with what you escape. But what you try to escape is always something that belongs to you intimately. Be it your karma or your unwanted belief systems, experiences, and so on. All of that is yours, part of the work you wanted to explore and to know in this density. And to transcend it, sooner or later. So as you don't like what you see here, you escape into the idea of I am, imagining that you have realized it that you have become it. But as long as you seek to escape any experience instead of fully accepting and embracing it and transcending it into unconditional love, you cannot and will not truly know I am. I am arises naturally as the reality of divine radiant source existence, when you have entirely surrendered all of your experiences, high and low, because they have no binding effect on you, as you fully have relinquished your identification with and reaction to them. I am is not based on a point with a circumference that you call I. It is not based on a separate entity. I am is not the I thought of that finite entity you are identified fault with. Because I am is not mortal, it is not mind based. Although I am is everything, it does not think at all. It is free of imagination and duality, desire and any idea about something. It is not an object you can think of or observe. As long as you observe, locate or look at I am, it remains an idea, a hopeful wish to have realized it already. And that you are enlightened and have no more work to do. Such is the delusion many of you are falling for, because of exotic and false ideas of new age teachings. There I am is nothing but an enlarged ego thought, a grandiose idea of false divinity where you are not required to do the real work to realize your highest truth, but instead you are stalled, lost in fantasy land. It is a deception to keep you from growing truly into me, your true self, to know and be I am, untouched by thoughts beliefs, concepts and thereby separate notions. I am merely my realm of perfect happiness and unconditional love. This truly is I am. I am not separate from you, and you not separate from me in truth. You are. Thoughtless. Beloveds, please understand that because of love I desire your true awakening in me to see you grow and not to be stuck in the prisons of senseless doctrines that do not serve your divine nature, keeping you in the illusions of mind and limitation. I am your true nature, free and radiant bliss, all love. I am. I am your God Self. Message conveyed by Yuta. Our God Self, I am, channeled by Yuta Pose Gerudo, October 28, 2016, at web page, Radiantly Happy, at blogspot. Dot com. Source link.
Uta post Garudal messages from the realms of light. Copyright Copyright 2016. All rights reserved. Uta post Garudal, radiantly happy, at blogspot.com. Please post your comments on my blog so that I can be aware of them. Please share this message only together with this information and without changes, including the title. If you have questions, please contact me via transformation33 at gmail.com. Thank you.